for today is matchups. Do you have some favorites? Or, or, or let's, let's right. pick favorites, but uh, pick the match that you really want to see for well, today's card, like which you're very excited about. There, there, there's a man. There's a there's a few. I mean, obviously, of course, Mike and Dave. I mean, you know, it's when we just were discussing it. Just I put my commissioner hat off, and as a fan, I'm like. I, I'm right up front for that bit. I can't wait to see that. But also, I, I'm interested to see how uh, Krasimir does against Marcio. I think that to me is a really great match because similar, similar, similar styles. Yeah, yeah similar and, and, yeah, and, and our styles make matches, yeah. right? Yeah. And and it's interesting. So where you, whereas you, with David, Mike, you have completely contrasting. You have a hit and a catch, right? Versus Marcio and Krasimir, which you have, you know, two bangers coming on. You know, that to me is exciting, and Krasimir, this is his second time here, so every time somebody new competes in the WAL, with our venue, rules are a little bit different, you know, pads are a little different, the crowds are different, the cameras, it's hard your first time. Yeah. Um, and, and also on top of it, for Krasimir, his first time he had day. Hey. <laughs> welcome to the WAL, you know, but it, it was what it was, um, but, but, but it's different this time, it's not, you know, it's not, you know, um, it's not new, yeah. so he knows what to expect. So I, I, I'm really interested in that. You know, it should be fun. And right, Justin Bishop. Yep. 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 Tell us about that match. Yeah. So I mean, it should be a great pull. He's a top roller. I'm a top roller. He's all about controlling in the hand. I'm all about controlling in the hand. So it's like from the outside perspective, it's you know we're both very similar in our technique. It all comes down to who knows that little bit more to get that Gets additional edge. angle, or who's been training harder, whatever it is, or who just believes they're gonna win it more. And I'll tell you right now, I lie to myself very, very well. Like when I tell myself I'm gonna win, I'm stupid enough to believe it and I can't. <laughs> Some of the magics, like Crossy versus Barbosa. Yeah. That, that, that will be a core? That should be really, you know, Barbosa is very much an offensive puller. He's all about ready to go, bam, he's gonna explode. Yeah. You know, and then you got him, he's, he likes going in that defense. And is he capable of stopping Marcio's hit so he can get it in his game? I don't know. You better have a super powerful hand, and I don't know if he's got that. I mean, you know, he doesn't have, he's a heavyweight with a middleweight hand. You know, he's got a smaller hand, so you know he's the guy that's gonna like go for that move and got to him inside. Yeah. Trust he's always good at getting Yeah, yeah. and he but knows can he stop. Can he? he knows how to hook without needing a hand, which is a powerful hook. I mean, like he knows how to get there. Your pick. My pick, I love Marcio. Yeah. You know, Marcio, you know, last year he did not finish up the way he wanted. I know he was fighting some demons in his head. Just like, whoa, what the heck's going on? It's like, I lost my first super match, I lost my second super match. And what that does to an athlete is it makes him, he's here. Yeah. Uh, can, first of all, can Mike stop Dave? And can Dave not get stopped? Yeah, it, the big question is, is if Dave gets stopped, yeah. is he gonna go ahead and blow his load and unload all his ammunition on him and just like make the mistake of like, Fighting, fighting, because you know, here's the thing about that style with Michael Tai. You, you get over and you're right here, and you're like, wow, I've got everything right here. I feel so strong. And your adrenaline's pumping, and you just want to punch into the pad. Yeah. And it's weird yeah. because that it's style, really you, you've you got everything your shoulders in position, and your hands in position, everything's in position. And then you go to punch with everything behind it, it just doesn't move. It's like you hit a wall. You know, so the big trick is, is I guess, two questions. Is, is Dave strong enough to just power on through that and do what most other arm wrestlers can't do, which they have not done yet? No one has easy matchups. Right. No. Or is Dave going to be smart enough to say, yep, I know you're strong there and I'm not going to fire inside because as soon as you fire inside and he stops you, you just got that confidence boost. You'd say that. Fire inside, you know he's locked in that position and you come back. Climb. And you climb. come back. Climb. You yeah. Even though you have everything, yeah. you don't. And yeah. Devil Lord said it. Yeah, yeah. it's like Devil Lord said it well. When you think you have everything, go, go climb higher. higher. And when you think you have everything now, climb higher. And when you think you have everything, you gotta keep climbing higher. Today's matchup. Yeah. Your plans? Hook. Um, or are you gonna try something else? I'm gonna try something new. Something I just new. learned a new technique. Uh, I'm, gonna cities, no? uh, I'm gonna try something new. Yeah. Today, big matchup. Big it's match. Very, very big match. As I said in my predictions, it's, I don't think they can beat you. I think you're. I hope you're right. <laughs> I think you're the hardest match for any heavyweight on the planet right now. So the question is, can you stop Dave in your position? I mean, that's what it's going to come down to. It's going to come down to ready to go, right? So um, 
Dave, to me, I feel is the biggest threat in the WAL. A lot of people think it's Devin. Uh, Devin has a lot of options. He's very technical. Dave's just raw power. Raw power is what I have to stop, right? So stopping Dave, to me, will be my biggest test in the WAL. So I've done everything I can possibly do up to this, to this point. I was talking the other day, I trained religiously for five months, dedicated to my nutrition, my training, my rest, my recovery, everything. And it's all going to come down to maybe five minutes of arm wrestling, right? So uh, I don't think I, I don't think it's going to be five minutes. I think it's going to be a war. I, I can never. Well, I was thinking, never about, I was, I thinking about five rounds. Even if he gets me the first two and I make him stop round three, yeah. that round three may be a minute match, and yeah. then he would fade in round four, yeah. thirty seconds. Round, you know what I'm saying? I, I don't know how long it's going to take. I just know I have to stop the match. Now I would love to win three zero, but uh, Dave Chafee is a wow. very strong man. So. There's nothing, I mean, it's, we're going to find out in what, about 10 hours, so I guess we'll see. Yeah. Today, Casimir Sadino. Yeah. So you have the uh, arms of Casimir before? We, we, we are one of those as a tour like two years ago. We lost some fouls. I lost some fouls. It was my first time going to back to WF rules and I struggled a little bit, but I, I don't know, I felt good with him inside and uh, on his game, so <laughs> trying to do it different this time, we'll see. You're looking. Big, very big, very <laughs> strong. You came prepared. Last season wasn't that good for you. Wasn't that good. D didn't I train you more. Went, you train more. Yeah, I train more. You know, I have a big family. I have a lot of work to do. <laughs> work a lot, and I probably didn't put all the effort I could. I've been trying to put more this year and to see where I, where I go from there. But you came prepared. Yes, I am. There's no excuse. You expecting a war or are you expecting a well, sweep? It's uh. It's always, you have to go to that first match to see, right? Yeah. Krasi is Krasi. He's famous, he's a kind of a legend already. Uh, he's famous, uh, he won multiple world titles, multiple so Europeans. Yeah. So I have a lot of respect for him, I like the guy. He was uh, one of the guys that I was looking, you know, to one day have a match with him. Yeah. And finally it's here. It came to the United States. So today a lot of good matchups too. Mike versus Bishop. Very good match. I kind of uh, don't know how to predict this. I think Mike Solaris is the most experienced guy. Maybe be Justin Bishop, maybe a little stronger, but he uses a lot of his hand and wrist, which is the same as Mike uses. You know, I it's gonna be tight. I think it's gonna be three two for one of them, one of them. It's hard to pick. Yeah. It's hard to pick I, those. Uh Tom and Yams. I would say Yanni's favorite because all the experience, you know, multiple world champion. Tom Holland is very good. I mean, he beat me in Dallas not too long ago. Yeah. Of course, he's a lighter guy, but it gives you uh, like an idea. It could be a hard match, but I would say that I, I see Giannis coming on the top just because of his more experience. I don't say about strength, but uh, his style, he pulled out WAL many times. He was, yeah. Really champ, so I think it's your favorite. Yeah. Uh, and a big one, Dave versus Mike. Incredible hard matchup. Hard pick. I think it's, I think Dave Shafee came prepared. He looks huge, he looks big, he looks ready for Michael. But at some point that match is going to stop. He might win first, second match, and Mike stop. He might win fast, first match, second match, maybe stop. Maybe Dave Shafee wins, but if Michael stop him for you know, anything over 45 seconds, it's gonna be over for the next one. So I would predict Michael to win, Thank like you. three two or something like that. Okay, good luck today. Thank you very much. much. I want to see your matchup. Yeah, you it's yeah. gonna be fun. Yeah. Thank you. For today's match, uh, how are you gonna win? What's, win what's, the score? <laughs> <laughs> what's the score? What's the score that you predict? You're predicting a sweep, easy win, or you're predicting more of a war? I'm predicting cards are going to win, but they're going to win. <laughs> yeah, that, that's, that's the sport of arm wrestling, but You know, you, you can try to predict a football game all day long, but at the end of the day, the sport's going to be what's going to be. You know, you just got to kind of roll with it. You got no control over that. I'm going to do the best I can do. Um, Have you armed? She's going to do the best she can do. Uh, no, no, she's no. been away for over 25 years now. Yeah. Um, so... We'll kind of just see how it goes. There's, uh, of course, you know, ideally I'd love 3-0. Yeah. You know, just a, a clean well, sweep like straight yeah. through. Um, but again, you know what? 
you the cards are gonna lay where they're gonna lay. Yeah. Mm. That's 